We're back for the second day of hoops action here at the Charleston Coliseum in the West Virginia State Boys Basketball Tournament. We open up day two with Class A quarterfinal action. Number three, Tucker County back in the Charleston Coliseum to take on a familiar opponent, number six, East Hardy, for the fourth time this season. The PVC rivals knew exactly what to expect today, and that served the Mountain Lions well early. Tucker with a flying start led by Ashton Licklider. Maddox Anderson dumps it inside for the big man who scores the first of his eight first quarter points. They can do it on the break too though. Trevin Bonner tracks the deep ball over the shoulder, slices his way to the hoop for two more. East Hardy staying in it thanks to some touch from behind the arc. J.W. Teets finds the bottom of the net from distance, but the Mountain Lions proved throughout this one they can shoot it too. Bonner drops it in the cup for three as Tucker shoots a blistering 46% from three in this game. Huge first quarter puts the Mountain Lions ahead 25 to 10, but East Hardy responds in the second. J.W. Teets whips one-handed pass to Jordan Teets for the three ball. The Cougars cut the deficit down to six, but here's a huge shot going into the half. Levi Bennett buries it with a hand in his face, and Tucker leads by nine at the break. That was all the momentum that the Mountain Lions needed early third quarter. Check out the second jump from Garrett Wilfong. Pogo stick bounce to go get the put back. From there, the Mountain Lions are rolling. Bennett pushing the pace on the run out, finds Anderson for the layup in transition. The lead stretches all the way to 25 points. Bennett picks out Ethan Rosenau, who knocks down the pull-up jumper. Tucker County puts five in double figures, led by 17 points from Bonner, and cruises past East Hardy into the Class A semifinals, 77-51. We run a lot of team offense. It's not we don't isolate and do a lot of stuff. We try to move the ball and we because we're guarded, we want you to guard too. We we want you to guard us too. We feel like if we guard you and you have to guard us for a period of time, by the fourth quarter we should be in pretty good shape. This Tucker County team has made it this far thanks to a little bit more than just good luck. The Mountain Lions are battle tested and in the process have found an exciting style of play that brings quite a bit of success. We couldn't put our finger, I just didn't like our effort because last year, I mean, that was never a question with this team. It's the same kids. So we started a little full court man. Hey, that's, that's making us play harder. Now let's, let's uh, go there and let's just push the basketball and see what happens. After seeing an East Hardy team that it knows all too well in the first round, the next opponent for Tucker County is going to be a new one, no matter who it is between Tug Valley and Wahama. I've watched Tug Valley probably three or four times. I went to the Palmer and traveled around, watched them a couple times. We were in their tournaments. I got to see them. Well, I've just seen on tape. We'll come watch them today, enjoy this for a couple hours. 